I have the same thing you people will not believe. I have seen mods where you can be enslaved by vampires. Yes. Where you can get cocoon by spiders. You are in a cocoon! Isn't that your worst nightmare ever? Where you can find yourself inside the stomach of a dragon. I'm falling into the Alduin stomach! But this is too much. This crosses a red line. This mod will bring to Skyrim the worst of all evil. The Taxman! Welcome again to Skyrim Watch! Sorrow and desperation have fallen over the once sunny land of Skyrim. As if the civil war wasn't enough, now there is a new plague roaming this province. Taxation! How does it work? Uh, once you install uh, Simple Taxes by Matthias Wog, you will got this MCM menu. From here you can decide how much uh, fiscal pressure will be put on you, something uh, which doesn't happen very often in real life. There is also uh, taxation, which is not really a property tax, it's more uh, it's a representation of the, of the cost of branding your horse. Then there is the house tax and the debt system. The debt system means that if you can't pay, the amount you have not paid will be charged to you, will be remembered and, char and charged to you the next time. Then you can set the amount you pay each time and how often the tax man will knock to your door. It can go from one day to each month. So what's so funny about uh, paying taxes? Well, this mod is made for those players, and I think there are a lot which think that the economy in Skyrim is a in vanilla Skyrim is a little bit broken. Basically, after a few levels, you are uh, you are full of money, and even the bounty for homicide it's uh, ridiculously low. So simple taxes add a kind of drain. It constantly drains your gold away. This way you won't get rich so easily and the money and looting will be more meaningful. Then it's realistic. We all talk about immersion in the game and so why some form of government taxation is, uh, is absent. In medieval ages they didn't have uh, income taxation, there was, there was no way to record uh, personal incomes, so they had mostly custom and property tax. So here we are, even the mighty Dragonborn, defeater of dragons, uh, has to submit the will of a voracious government. Be it the Imperials which have to support their Imperial bureaucracy, or Alfred Stormclocks, who needs your money to rise his rebellious armies. There is a lot of excitement about this mod and a lot of new ideas and development. In the latest update has been implemented the immersive taxation system, which means your taxes won't be detracted automatically, but a taxman will come to collect. Not Telia, sorry, but uh, just the basic courier, for now at least. And if you can pay all the money, a bounty will be put on your head. Another cool idea would be to implement different uh, taxation levels for each old in Skyrim. And maybe if you fail to pay your house taxes, you got uh, locked away, so your property will be put under sequestration by the government until you pay what is due. And then what about followers, don't they have need to like your horses? Isn't it strange that you pay those mercenary 500 gold and they follow you for all your life? Well, that's all, uh, I'm sure that simple taxes will get less simple and more complex with uh, each upgrade. For the moment paying your taxes has never been so much funny. Unless uh, you are in real life, of course. You'll never take me alive! Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe and uh, see you next. Bye.